This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. This reading by Kara Schallenberg. Letters of Two Brides by Honoré de Balzac. Letter 37. The Baron de Macumer to the Vicomtesse de l'Estrade. Genoa. My beloved beauty, I was bitten with the fancy to see something of Italy, and I am delighted at having carried off Macumer, whose plans in regard to Sardinia are postponed. This country is simply ravishing. The churches, above all the chapels, have a seductive, bewitching air, which must make every female Protestant yearn after Catholicism. Macumer has been received with acclamation, and they are all delighted to have made an Italian of so distinguished a man. Philippe could have the Sardinian embassy at Paris if I cared about it, for I am made much of at court. If you write, address your letters to Florence. I have not time now to go into any details, but I will tell you the story of our travels, whenever you come to Paris. We only remain here a week, and then go on to Florence, taking Leghorn on the way. We shall stay a month in Tuscany, and a month at Naples, so as to reach Rome in November. Thence we return home by Venice, where we shall spend the first fortnight of December, and arrive in Paris, via Milan and Turin, for January. Our journey is a perfect honeymoon, the sight of new places gives fresh life to our passion. Macumer did not know Italy at all, and we have begun with that splendid cornice road, which might be the work of fairy architects. Good-bye, darling. Don't be angry if I don't write. It is impossible to get a minute to oneself in travelling. My whole time is taken up with seeing, admiring, and realising my impressions. But not a word to you of these till memory has given them their proper atmosphere. End of letter 37 Read on August 30th, 2007, in Oceanside, California.